Hi, folks, we're from GalaxyS4Root.com. Uh, so I've got a quick ROM overview of a CM 10.2 uh, Android 4.3. Um, it is available. I've got it running on my GTI 9505 and also my Verizon. Uh, also on my GTI 9500, the OctaCore. Now, um, you can also install uh, install it. There are versions available for AT&T, T-Mobile, if you have Canadian, uh, US Cellular. Um, the Qualcomm versions on the Verizon and uh, everybody else is pretty good. It, the octa-core version is pretty good also. Um, just I haven't been able to get the camera working um, too well. And also the, for the Verizon version, the focal camera works well. Um, the regular camera doesn't work well. But what I did is install the Android 4.3 Photosphere camera uh, from my high on Android.com and uh, it worked. And also the GTI 9505 AT&T T-Mobile Canadian version and US cellular version is really, really solid. Everything working out of the box. Only problem I had with uh, the camera, um, it didn't work at first. It forced close on me, but I rebooted once. After that, it worked just fine. And I've got the regular AOSP camera here working just fine, as you can see here. And the focal camera is working flawless. Uh, which I really like and I have a full tutorial guide on this if you guys want to check it out um, overview of this camera uh, pretty nice stuff and uh, other than that battery life seems pretty darn good um, as far as comparing it to Google Play Edition uh, with the CM 10.2 obviously you, you get a couple more options um, it's not as fast um, on the benchmarks, but don't believe everything in, you see on the benchmarks. I mean, it doesn't mean that it's actually slower. Uh, it runs pretty darn fast. I mean, it's going to run way faster than your TouchWiz UI. Um, so very nice ROM. Some of the stuff, let me show you with CM 10.2 that you can do. Some of the customizations, uh, launcher, you can mess with your number of home screens, uh, drawer, dock, general. Um, and also in lock screen, you'll be able to uh, change your shortcuts. One, two, three, four, five different shortcuts. You can set it to um, different stuff, your applications, your camera. Uh, whoops, camera. And make sure you hit save and that will change your shortcuts, of course. And also um, button actions. All right, you can change the button actions, what they do in the lock screen. Um, a bunch of stuff you can do with widgets there. And also if you go to system, you'll also be able to um, change some stuff with status bar, quick uh, settings panel. You, you'll be able to change your tiles here um, and also enable expanded desktop. Power menu, you'll be able to add screenshot there. And also hardware keys, if you want to change um, what these keys do, um, you can customize, customize them as you want. Uh, so overall, very solid ROM for the GTI 95, AT&T T-Mobile, US Cellular, uh, almost you know 100% stable. Also for the Verizon, same thing. Um, the GTI 9500 version is a little bit buggy. It really boots, reboots sometimes. So I don't actually recommend it as a daily driver. Uh, but for Verizon, AT&T, T-Mobile, Canadian, and GTI 9505, uh, and US Cellular, definitely check it out. Um, you know, if you're looking for, you know, one of the best Android 4.3 ROMs right now with focal camera, the regular ASB camera, um, definitely this is a great option. And also this means um, since a lot of ROMs like AUKP ROMs are built off CM 10.1, um, there's going to be a lot of great stable ROMs uh, for the Galaxy S4 um, so soon. Um, so definitely check it out and also root for this. This ROM does have root. I have a fix for it. You simply got to go uh, to about phone. I'll just show you two real quick. Um, so you don't have to watch that video again. Uh, make sure you enable the uh, hit the build number a bunch of times until it says you're a developer. Go to developer options and make sure under root access you're, you're set it to apps and ADB and that will make you know um, your ROM fully rooted and you'll be able to run your custom ROMs. Anyway, check it out for this week's ROM of the week uh, for Verizon, uh, AT&T, T-Mobile, GTI 9505, Canadian, US Cellular, and also um, sort of a beta version. If you're going to install on the GTI 9500, 
um, just try it out and I would flash back to whatever ROM you're running because it's it's not that stable right now. Uh, but you can try it out, it's out there, the test version is out there and there should be stable versions um, in, the, in the next couple weeks or so and I'll have a, um, you know, another um, you know, update when the stable versions are available. Anyway, thanks guys for watching this video. As always, if you have a Galaxy S4, don't forget to sign up for my email list at galaxyS4root.com. We update you once a week uh, with ROM of the Week, tips, hacks, and more. And also, if you're on YouTube, please hit that like button for me here. Subscribe button there. And I will see you guys soon. Uh, stay high on Android.